Papa's old study. This was where the fisherman had learned to make models, sitting at Papa's knee, listening to Papa's gruff, scratchy voice telling him to try again, try again, and next time get it right. The fisherman was nearly there, but something in this room seemed different, like he was being watched. and I'm not impressed. Papa? The painting, the old painting of his father, the, the great fisherman, it was talking. Quiet, I'm talking. My only child, my flesh and blood. You could have been as great a sailor as me, or my father before me. Ah, Papa, that you had lived to see this day. Papa, said the puppet, I must light the lighthouse lamp. A ship is in peril. My own son, a mere lamp lighter, a landlubber, nonsense. All you need is a boat and a strong net. Show your true sea dog and sail out there. you about the time I caught a fish as big as you? Bigger, in fact. Much bigger. I think you left one of the pieces outside waiting for the paint to dry. lighthouse crane were there on the balcony. The huge half-flooded room surrounded him and below he could see the tiny replica of the room. So it's come to this. My own son. Puh, a lighthouse keeper. <laughs> the door upstairs was rusted shut. Besides, Papa had given him an order, and a true sailor always obeys the skipper. Fishing, but he's an art. No, a craft. No, an art. Aboard a craft. <laughs> I'm writing that down.
so it's going to be my own son. Your mother would be sad to see these two. Not me, of course. I was always a very supportive parent. Fishing. It is an art. No, a craft. No, an art. A border craft. <laughs> I'm writing that down. The right part of the hurl is drying somewhere. Outside. So it's come to this. My own son, a lighthouse keeper. Fishing. It is an art. No, a craft. No, an art. A border craft. <laughs> I'm writing that down. Did I ever tell you about the time I caught a fish as big as you? Bigger, in fact. Much bigger. Nearly there. Who am I kidding? 
You never finish anything. You left one of the pieces outside, waiting for the paint to dry. It's a good, honest vessel. Well, what are you waiting for? All aboard! Now, duck it at the pontoon. Then we'll see who's too big for his father's boat. set sail. Lower that boat into the water.
Don't touch that rudder, boy. We are bound for the biggest catch of our lives. Stay on course. Cast off! East by Northeast! Full steam! Look at you. You look almost like a real sailor. If I squint. Thanks, Papa. Morning fish fans, fishing season has begun and stocks are looking thin again this year. We all know there's a big catch waiting out there somewhere, but hold your hauling lines. Reports are saying a huge storm is blowing in. <laughs> the storm approaches. That's when the fish come easily, my son. Coming up next, another hour of thrilling nautical news after these The fish are waiting. Activate the winch. Drop the nets. Storm! This is where nature hides its beauties! They're waiting for us! Ha 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 ha! Come in, trawler. Come in, trawler. If you can hear us, return to port immediately. I repeat, return to port immediately. Forget, boy! Come back with a hold full of fish, or don't come back at all! Those poor souls who are sailing out there, driven on by their disappointed fathers. I only wanted you to be greater than me. But I didn't. Au revoir, Papa. Then, as he climbed the hook, he thought of all the models he had built, all the days he had spent inside the lighthouse, hiding from his fear. I don't know what you've been hiding from, but I've been hiding from the storm! His greed. You, land livers, have everything you want, don't you? And his obsession. That shadow which had seemed so large once upon a time. The greatest catch ever is out there, please. At last, we turn on the light. Here we go. 